The mobile gaming market is an $18 billion market and Pocket Change is a growing company. How do you see yourself fitting into this entire marketplace as you guys are helping to monetize mobile games? So Pocket Change is in the virtual currency space. Our ambition is to power the virtual currency of all of these mobile games and more and more uh, mobile games are having in-app economies and all of these in-app economies are powered by currency. And so we really want to be that virtual currency layer across all games. So this isn't my first startup. I started another company called Gum Gum, which is in the advertising space in Los Angeles. I've always been interested in tech. I was a programmer in high school and um, what drives me is the idea that I can solve problems. Um, problems that if I can solve will help people at the end of the day, right? And so our whole thing is to have fun, right? We want people to play games and have fun. And if we can create a currency that helps them to have more fun, then we're golden. On average, um, a gamer has 30 games on their phone. And right now they spend on average about $7 per year on games. So whether it's buying the game to play it or they're buying something inside the game, um, there's a tremendous amount of purchasing power. Your token is based on the US penny. Mm -hmm. What are the parallels between in-game economies and real world economies? Yeah, so I mean, if you think about like a real world economy, it's really the currency that allows for all of the value creation. It's the reason why you're here interviewing me. It's you want more money. I'm participating in this interview because I want more money. And so in a virtual economy, the currency allows for value creation inside the game. Like you want to get further in a game, you need to either earn the currency or purchase the currency to get more corn for your farm or machine gun or whatever it is that you want in that little micro economy. And what we've seen is really sophisticated game developers are starting to hire uh, economics majors, philosophy majors, and trying to really create a virtual economy.